for our, uh, for the next for this series, we decided that we wanted to recreate as much as possible the kind of collaboration that we had on the first series. And to do that, we decided we would go to Florida and just spend a week there working and making notes and seeing the landscape and um, really trying to figure out exactly what we wanted to do. Yeah, I grew up in Florida, uh, so I knew it pretty well, but I really wanted you to be able to kind of absorb not just the beachy, tropical parts that everybody thinks of Florida, but the woods and the scrubby habitats and stuff, which is where a lot of the adventure is going to happen. So we went up to... Um, Jonathan Dickinson, which is this huge state park. We took a lot of photos, we took a lot of notes. I took you to uh, the Blowing Rocks Preserve on the beach where the rocks were and all the waves would blast through the rocks and we're gonna do a scene there and stuff. And it was interesting for me because I grew up near the beach too, but on the Jersey Shore and in some ways it was a very similar train and in some ways it was really, really different. Mm -hmm. And so it was great to be able to kind of take notes uh, about the description and get some books and um, Kind of really also hunker down and get the details hammered out and and we did I'm we did. really happy with uh, what we got yeah put out. yeah me too I think it's good I think we were a little worried that the um, the original spark and the magic at least I was um, you know it came so naturally to us when we first did the first set of books and then to be able to really recapture that to me uh, was really important and what was awesome was w once we got down to Florida we were able to really sit down and, and there it was, the magic mm -hmm. and the energy and the ideas and stuff. And so it was really an excite. it was totally like the same excitement that we had. It was really fun. It was really cool.